Rick Gibson. I'm an HD2. I work for the traffic department and I've been here six years. Ted Corey, I work for the traffic department. I've been here nine and a half years. Today we're setting up a detour to close State Route 81 in preparation for the railroad to fix a crossing. The difference between setting up for another contractor other than ourselves is the pre-planning that goes into it. Uh, we've already made set up the advance signing from every direction letting traffic know which way they're being rerouted to get them back on course with the minimal amount of disruption in the traffic flow so that's basically our that's what we're trying to accomplish most of the time it works sometimes it doesn't uh, it depends on what how the traffic perceives about what we're doing and if they pay attention to the signs if they follow the signs they'll be in good shape if they don't, then they're going to find themselves doing a lot of backing up and turning around. Uh, go ahead, Ted. Well, people are actually not following the route that we set up. Well, within the zone itself, which can cause a big problem. Uh, accident, well, is them getting all turned around and lost. That's the biggest frustration. Overall, working for the state of Ohio, ODOT in general, is pretty decent. Every employer, every place of employment has its drawbacks, but they have their plus side too. So I try to remain positive. I try to look on the positive side of things. And as long as you remain that way, your job will go pretty good. We have a pretty good group of guys that we work with. We got a decent, decent boss. And uh, so things flow for us as long as we remain positive and keep it, keep looking at it from that standpoint. Well, just to add to that, I would say ODOT's a pretty secure place to work. Uh, it has its perks. It's like any other town, it's like any other town. It's all the way you look at it on a daily basis. Uh, originally coming to ODOT, I worked at the county work unit in maintenance. And although you get to see a lot of things and do a lot of things in the county, the traffic department offers you the ability to see all the counties within your district. So now I'm, I'm working in eight different counties and depending on what's going on every day, that's a that's a plus for me. You get to move around more, you get to meet more people that work for the state, and you're involved in more things. Uh, I'm in total agreement. Uh, it's like working around the state, like working around the counties, uh, knowing that we're doing good for the public get them to and fro to where they have to go. Most of our job is entails the signing. The signing of state routes and state highways. And it gives the public the ability to know what's going on in advance, such as these detours we set up. But the signing in general lets people know where they're at, which direction they're heading, and the you know hazards ahead. I guess I could say. So it's our job to make sure that we're keeping them safe. Well, I would say, uh, let me go to the recent sign that we put up, uh, heavy reflective type sign. We really asked that the look of the uh, signs. We also asked where people actually see the signs themselves. I mean, it's like, it's like sunshine. Uh, there's no way to miss it unless your eyes are closed. Unless you're not looking at the sign itself. Uh, I'm saying, and you're taking out the sign, uh, visibility is excellent. I, I guess I could just add to that is from our boss's perspective, you know, if we see something broke, fix it. It's not something we just drive by and look at. If we see a sign down that represents something that we're trying to accomplish, then we need to fix it. You know, fix it before somebody has a complaint about it. 